does this thing work here? Um, it's infrared signal. Yeah. Right. We, can't, we, we can't see infrared, but cause to us it's invisible, but you can see it on camera. Okay, so Emily, let's show that real quick. Hold on. There's a flashing. Now, don't send a signal. Let go. And the flashing stops. Do it again. And it's flashing. So on camera, that's how you can tell if your remote control at home, if the batteries need to be rechanged. If you put your camera in front of the infrared light on the remote control, you can see the light flashing. And if it needs new batteries, and it's, it means it's not flashing, or if it's not flashing, it needs new batteries. Okay, so we experimented with the mirror to see if the range of, what's this called again? A hex bug. A hex bug would go farther. So bring it back, Ben. Okay, let's see how far it goes. Let's turn it around this time. Let's see how far it goes. Okay. We're not going to use the mirror right now. How, how long is the table, Benjamin? Six feet. Okay. Yeah, keep going. It's hard to make it go straight. Yeah, it does got wobbly. Same thing with every straight. Oh, you need to hold it. Um, he was holding it flat with that, yeah. We need to hold it at the right, at a fixed height to be... Oh, he stuck. Okay. Does it tilt to the left or to the right? Because if it tilts to the right, hold the left longer, Is and it it'll make it go forward. Yeah, that's as far as it'll go. Okay, Mason, do the mirror. What? It went farther than that earlier. Okay, now it's turned around. Okay, go. So, Mason, why is the mirror helping it, even though it stops? the infrared light is hitting the mirror and going back onto this. That is pretty awesome. So how far can we, let's see how far we could go. I only pointed up a bit. Yeah, Mason. Yeah, yeah, keep going. That's a really good trick. It makes me think that instead of a, a regular radio controlled antenna, which is usually metal, the infrared would be better with a mirror. So instead of antennas being on top of things, maybe a mirror. Would. Can we get all the way to the end? So we're getting another... We're over six feet, right? Yeah. Yeah. Like, way Let's see if we can get it to go all the way to the end of the table. Wait, and you know how you can tell? It could probably, probably go farther than this. Yeah. yeah. Hey, it's not a magnifying glass. It's a mirror. I know, but one side of the mirror makes hey. it look Hey. Hey. Hey, we're trying to do an experiment too. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so glad you brought this, Emily. This is interesting. My mom would love me at first. Stop moving it! Okay, but if you hold it, it at, it, um, keep going. She is, she is doing, she's doing a good job. I was talking about the mirror. Okay, Guys, flip the mirror it. over because it's magnified on the other side. You got to get the right angle though. Closer. There you I go. Got it, I got it. Okay, make sure it doesn't go off the table. Keep going, keep going. So what did we learn from this? What does the mirror help us do then? Uh, it helps it, the infrared uh, glare, infrared light glares off the mirror, and uh, it goes to the signal right there. Steven right there. That was a great thing. Let's pop that on the internet.